Yes, I have made well over $3,000 with Creative Fabrica selling digital products that I never touched. And you might be wondering, well, there's only $2,000 here. What are you talking about? Let me show you the other $1,000. So this is my second account on Creative Fabrica that I started about six months ago. And I've been making a little bit more each single month okay and as of now i have about 150 listings on this account and the other account about about 250 listings in total okay my goal is about i want to reach thousand listings this year on this account especially especially because i've been working more on this account than the other one and i'm selling digital products on another website as well which actually making money on that website as well every single day and uh it's getting better month by month and you know it's getting it's it's uh, it's progressing over time okay so let me break down how i what i have when i started and how things did go and how i basically been able to make this amount of money okay so i started creative fabric back in about november i would say not november, I mean, october november 2021 so i had this account for a little bit over a year now and uh i've been you know two thousand dollars is not too bad right the thing is with creative fabrica that i should say is you should keep up uploading consistently so since am i uploading uh decreased especially with this account my earnings decreased as well so you gotta keep uploading uh designs every single month i would recommend that the very least like maybe around 10 listings a month i tend to try to upload more but to the other account not to this one this one i upload maybe two three listings each month or something like that but uh yeah so that's what uh and so on this account my first account i had i have coloring pages mostly it's like 80 percent of the stuff that i have i have canva templates quite a few of them and the uh, kdp interiors which is like 20 percent of maybe 15 percent or something like that you do the math on that but basically here i have mostly uh coloring pages and stuff like that but to be fair since my journey came out coloring pages that are quite competitive uh it's easier to create them now in the past i used to hire people to create them but still the quality of illustrators is still better than mid journey if i'm being quite honest but it's just easier and uh more practical to just create them with mid journey because it takes less time and it's just easier basically but uh that's how it is that's how basically how i made the two thousand dollars on this account with the other account i started this one in august okay and um since i've been uploading svgs graphics and uh, fonts as well but i mostly have graphics and svgs and i believe svgs are the one that has made me the most money so far even though i can't really track on creative fabrica which one has made me the most i can just see a few cells here and there but i can't really tell which one is which but i just can tell from the the amount of favorites that i have on certain products okay so that's basically how i made on this store my second store on creative fabrica i have about 150 listings so far and i've been able to make a thousand dollars and um, i'm trying to reach a thousand listings on creative fabrica with svgs and graphics but i have a high standard for the quality so i can't upload anything and everything obviously you know i want to keep that momentum of having high quality and you know so because those they tend to what works better for me and i think i believe that's the same thing even with like kdp or something like that like you gotta you know make sure the quality is there otherwise like you're just gonna be wasting your time anyway because no one is gonna pay any attention to like a low quality product and uh yeah so that's basically it this is how i made a thousand dollars i started the second account and i've been focused more on the quality i saw more potential with svgs and graphics and that's what i've been doing and uh you might be wondering how do i create those stuff okay so now i would say it's 50 50 some of them are made by me using photoshop illustrator i do stuff on my own okay and some other ones like fonts they're mainly hire people like spent like hundred dollars on creating few fonts like about hundred dollars creating few fonts uh they did not do too well but 
you know one of them did somewhat well so maybe that one will pay for the other ones um on graphics i hire people some of them i created them myself svgs mostly hire people um and i started using mid journey recently too so i've been doing that as well so yeah there's a mix of things that i'm doing right now so this is basically how i did it how much i made everything like that um i hope you found this video valuable if you did please make sure to like and subscribe and i'm um, actually making money on other website as well i think i said it. Uh, i'm making money on other website as well selling digital products as well design bundles to be more specific i made almost 500 dollars on that one as well so i'm pretty i'm doing i'm progressing over time you know and um i now trying to figure out kdp Trying to get two thousand dollars per month at the very least and within this year uh since i have a little bit of money to invest to that and uh yeah so basically this is how it did how, how i did it and how you can do it and maybe you will do better than me even so thank you very much for watching and see you in the next video peace